Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. <laughs> so as you guys can see from the title of today's video, today's video is going to be a September BoxyCharm unboxing video. This is my first ever BoxyCharm unboxing video and I'm so excited to be doing this, honestly. Like I'm really, really stoked. I don't know what it is about it. Like I'm excited because I've never done a video like this. This is my first time ever doing any kind of unboxing for a like monthly prescription service. I've been getting it for the past like five months and I just keep forgetting to talk about it. But I sent out a tweet like, do you guys want to see me do a BoxyCharm unboxing video? And I got so much positive feedback saying like, yes, you better fucking do that unboxing. And I was like, okay, I'll do it. I got super inspired to do them because of Kathleen Light. She does BoxyCharm unboxings every month. And I'm like, Kathleen, you inspired me to do them too full. And since I get them every month, I'm like, why the hell don't I do unboxings? So let me know what you guys thought of it. I mean, what you guys think of this kind of thing. If you guys want me to do it every month, I can totally do that. But if you guys don't want me to, let me know as well, because I, I don't have to do this. This is just a new thing. If you guys want me to do it, I can totally do it. If not, let me know. Let me know if you don't want it. Speaking of Kathleen Lights, I really wanted to wear her lipstick in this video, so I am. I'm wearing her new lipstick, Miami Fever by Ofra Cosmetics. Kathleen and Ofra did a collaboration, and they created this beautiful terracotta warm, intense orangey color, and I think it's absolutely beautiful. The formula is amazing. The lipstick is amazing. I'm so proud of you, Kathleen. If, you, if you're watching this, I'm so proud of you. Congratulations on it. I just wanted to support you, and I love you so much. I know Kathleen has a code for this. I'm not really sure what it is exactly. I'll leave it down below and where you can also get Ofra Cosmetics. If you guys are interested in it, but I just really wanted to wear it and I think it goes perfect with this look I'm wearing like I'm very like bronzy and very glowy and very like warm But yeah, other than that if you guys like this video if you guys don't like me, please don't watch it You don't have to feel free to not comment if you guys don't like this video because I really don't give a fuck You know, I don't give a fuck. But yeah, if you guys do like this video and you guys do like me Please subscribe to my channel and like it thumbs up click it but yeah, let's get into this unboxing. I feel like that intro is going to be so fucking long. Holy shit. That was a long intro. I can feel it in my bones. I got my little box, and I got my little scissors. It's a little crane. It's fucking cute. So let's go into this unboxing, bitch. I haven't unboxed it yet. It's fucking cool. I don't know. Unbox it. Open the thing. <gasps> okay. So as you can see, it says run... Okay, so it says runway... Why can't I say runway? Runway. 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 So it says runway re runway ready. I cannot say runway re ready in the same sentence quickly. Runway ready, runway ready. <sighs> and this is the September 2015 collection of the Charmers. That's fucking cute. And so it has like all the things on the back of it. I think I'll read them off, but I'm going to just get things first. First thing I looked at in the box is these. This is a Smolder Eyes by Tarte. It's an Amazonian clay waterproof liner. It looks like that. It looks like these. It's like a little just gel liner thing, I think. Oh, that's pretty. It's like a little, it's like a golden bronze. It's like a bronze and gold. I actually have a couple of these. I, I never actually tried them though. Yeah, I should probably start using them. Cool, great. I'll try it. Next one is the Provise Skin Type 1 through 6. Hydration with potent antioxidant botanicals hydro milk contains. Wait, hold on, let me try that again. Hydration with potent antioxidant botanicals. Hydro milk contains active levels of natural ingredients to help improve skin hydration and fight free radicals. What are you, you fucking bitch? Hydro milk? What is that? Oh, I think it's a moisturizer. I think it's a moisturizer. Provides skin type. I'm just gonna squeeze a little bit on the back of my hand. Looks like that. Two fluid ounces. That's a fuck ton. Okay, so the consistency is very watery. It's very watery. It feels very nice. It smells like a spa. Ooh, it smells fucking good. I like that shit. I like that. I'm gonna try that out. Protects from free radicals. That I'm already like game, game, like game over. Yes, I'm all about free radical protection. Next, we got the Chella Eyebrow Defining Gel. It's a little wrapping. Oh, bitch. And this is a clear brow gel. I tried their brow pencils before, and I really like the Chella brow pencils. So I'm hoping that these are gonna be just as good. I'm all about clear brow gels. I think brow gel is super important. I used to do the whole like fleek brow and filling them in with like brow pomades and stuff like that, but now I just do brow gel. Usually I use colored, but clear brow gel on days they don't wear makeup is like essential for me. So. Brow gel, it is. Ooh, okay, so we have a Vasanti brush. A Vasanti face brush. The average foundation paddle brush. It just, the bristles aren't my favorite bristles ever. But, you know what? It's still a brush, it's a face brush. You can use moisturizer, primer, anything with a face brush. I mean, it's a flat paddle brush. The ferrule and the body feels really, really, really nice, actually, though. Like, it feels very well made. I just don't like the bristle type. I just feel like the bristles aren't soft enough. Maybe if I wash it, it'll be softer. I just don't like the way the bristles feel, but that's just personal preference. That's just not my style. I'm really used to the Morphe brushes, and I really like their material a lot more. Like, it's very, very soft and synthetic, so I really like the way those feel. But, you know what? It is a face brush in, like, a $22 little box. Like, that is bomb as fuck. Like, really? It's good. 
Okay, so this is the last thing. These are scratch limited edition nail, what the fuck are you? Nail wraps. I don't know what a nail wrap is. So, I'm assuming what this is, it's like a little like press on nail thing. They're like little stickers for your nails, which is really cool. Oh my God, that's different. Let me zoom in. Is it focusing? I'm assuming it's like little nail tattoos that you like press on to the nail and it's good to go. I honestly like for me, for a boy, being a boy and I don't paint my nails or anything like that, this would be such a cool thing to do. Like if I wanted to just get a little something summon on these nails, on these cracked ass nasty as fuck nails. Cause I have nasty nails, honestly. My nails suck. <laughs> Look at them. Awesome shit. Awesome shit. This is actually the last thing. Oh my god. So this is from Kardashian Beauty. The Kardashians. Like, Kim Kardashian? <laughs> so this is the Kardashian Beauty Black Seed Dry Oil. Apply a small amount into your hands and distribute evenly into hair. This is just like a dry oil for the hair. Like, you just put it in your hair. You can style it, things like that. It's just an oil. I'm not really sure exactly. I don't really use oils in my hair. Yeah, I just don't do oils in my hair. So I'm not really sure about this thing. But I'll definitely try it out at least once. I want to try it. I mean, it's from Kardashian, so I'm kind of curious because I never actually tried any of the Kardashian stuff. So I'm excited about that. So let me just go ahead and read off the prices of everything because that's obviously a huge important part. Like, how much is everything worth? So so the first thing is the Provise Skincare Hydro Milk Hydrating Lotion. It's full size and it is $48 for this bitch. It's 40, 48 what the fuck do you think you are, Provise? So it's $48. This is super, super, super expensive. Excited to try that out. Like, hell yes. Okay, so that's that. Vasanti Professional Foundation Brush. This is full size and it retails for $32. You are not worth 32, you fucking whore. You are not worth 32. I like the shape of it. Don't get me wrong. I like the shape of it. I like the ferrule. I like the body. It feels very well made. I just don't like the bristle. It's not my type of bristle. You know what I mean? It's just personal preference. You guys could be loving and living for the bristle, but it's just not my thing. It's not mine. It's not my thing. Next is these Tarte Smolder Eyes Amazonian Clay Waterproof Liner. Full size, 22. I knew it. I knew it. So the BoxyCharm box is 22 bucks, and this alone is 22. So that's pretty, like, Gnarls Barkley. That's really crazy. Oh my god, I'm, like, really... Really pleasantly surprised. Honestly, like, I'm obsessed with Tarte. I love Tarte. I think Tarte is so freaking good. Next, Chella Eyebrow Defining Gel. Full size, of course. And it is $18 for the full size. Chella Brow Gel for $18? That is expensive as freaking hell. Next one is the Scratch Nail Wraps. Full size, of course. And it's $12 for the Scratch Nail Wraps. This is 12 bucks, which I could totally expect. I'm assuming, like, most things like this, like, nail, like, press-on type things are expensive. It's for convenience, too. And they're really cute, so... Totally, like, totally worth it. The Kardashian Beauty Dry Seed Oil is a travel size. It's not, it's just a bonus item. It's not, um, in here for, like, price-wise. It's just a little bonus little, like, travel size dry oil, you know? What is this worth total? Oh, my God, I'm really curious. Let me just add up everything on my phone because I can't do the math in my head. Too lazy. I'm too lazy. $132. So, the total price of this entire box, like, retail-wise is $132 and you only spend $22. The reason I'm even doing this BoxyCharm unboxing video is because BoxyCharm is my favorite box service of every box service I've ever seen or received. I think BoxyCharm is the best. The fact that you're getting full size items, most of the time you're getting full size. I don't know, man. I just think it's really, 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 really good. And I think that BoxyCharm really takes so much time to make the best box they can possibly make, especially like for the price. You're paying $22 and the value was $132, for example, in just September's box. So I think that's really crazy. Honestly, I think that's really great. And that's why I wanted to do this. And yeah, that's it for the entire box. That's the September BoxyCharm box. I just did an unboxing for it. I hope you guys liked it. Let me know if you guys like this kind of video. If you guys want me to do monthly unboxings, I can totally do monthly unboxings or if you guys want to see me do specific things with the products in it let me know that as well you know I can try to do like some more swatches or I can do some stuff on my face if you guys want to see that you know what I mean so let me know what you guys thought of this video if you if I did okay in the my first boxy charm unboxing honestly like I would really love your feedback especially if I'm gonna be doing this more if you guys like me doing boxy charm unboxings let me know like this video and I will do more every month I'll do one might as well I mean again I might as well show you guys you know I'm not gonna do this you guys think this fucking sucks if I suck at it, just don't, I'm not gonna do it, you know? Please feel free to follow me on Instagram, Twitter, Snapchat, everything will be linked down below as well as the box or where you can get the little box and stuff like that. But yeah, other than that, have a great rest of the night or day wherever you guys are and I'll catch you in my next video. Bye, you guys. I swear I'm gone for like three days and I can't film. <laughs> so, as you can see, light, you're trying me right now. A unboxing video, this is my first ever I almost said Ipsy. Oh my god, sorry about the charm. I almost said Ipsy. Let's try that again. Hey guys, welcome. Is my fan on? Can you hear that shit? There's a plane. Mm hmm? Mm hmm? Okay. Wrap it up, plane. Wrap it up. Go over me. I talk with my hands a lot. I don't know if you guys can notice, but I do this a lot. Mother, you're in this house. Why aren't you in my room? Hello? Yes, I'm filming. <laughs> <laughs> Why am I so hyper? I haven't even, I haven't even had Diet Coke today. And I'm fucking hyper little bitch. I'm hyper little bitch. Hm. Run Ray, run Ray ready.
<laughs> Ugh, I had a little paper in me. The access platform for creating all backgrounds to... Am I supposed to read this shit? Or what the fuck? <gasps> I'm missing one more thing! Oh, there was one more thing in here, but it fell onto my thigh. Okay, no, I just didn't feel it because my thigh thighs are fat as fuck. Oh. <coughs> Ugh. <coughs> fuck me, sideways? Do I look like a goddess? Why is my camera... Why is it blinking? I feel like it's gonna explode. Stop. Don't!